वेलकम टू माई चैनल कोड कैनवास इन वन ऑफ द प्रीवियस वीडियोज वी लर्न अबाउट एंथ चाइल्ड सी एस एस सुडो सिलेक्टर विथ एग्जाम्पल्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी अ सिमिलर काइंड ऑफ सी एस एस सुडो सिलेक्टर एंथ लास्ट चाइल्ड सी एस एस सुडो सिलेक्टर सो एंथ लास्ट चाइल्ड सिलेक्ट अलाउज यू टू सिलेक्ट वन और मोर एलिमेंट्स बेस्ड ऑन देयर सोर्स ऑर्डर according to the formula it is defined in a css selector level 3 specification as a structural pseudo class it means it is used to style content based on its relationship with parent and sibling elements it functions exactly same as nth child except one difference that it selects items starting at the bottom of the source code not the top so let's see an example suppose we have one list and we have unknown number of items in that list and we want to highlight the second to last item okay so let's see we have one unordered list and li for example we have five li and let me add content first item second one third item fourth one and last is fifth item so we have five items but we might have unknown number of items and we want to select we want to highlight the second to last item this one so what we can do we can give class something here and in css we can use this class to highlight but let's say we don't know how many items we have and we don't want to give class so in that case we can use the end last child css pseudo selector okay so let's give the background color first of all background let's give flat gray and see how it looks so as you can see we have five items and background color flat gray and we want to select the second last item what we can do we can write down li and last child 2 and let's give background color light slight gray and font color red so we can see the difference as you can see the second last li is highlighted with this background color and color let's change the value of the argument to 3 and see what happens as you can see it is selecting the third item from the bottom okay so rather than using the class you can always use nth last child and you can always give css so you don't need to write down class name in the html so as you can see nth last child takes an argument this can be either this one argument this can be a single integer like 1 2 3 4 5 the keyword even or odd or some formula if an integer is specified only one element is selected but the keywords or the formula will iterate through all the children of the parent element and select the matching elements from the list or element html okay so this was the basic introduction and here you want to 
note one thing that nth last child iterates through elements starting from the bottom of the source order this is the only difference between nth last child and nth child and the later iterate through the elements starting from the top to the source order the nth child so that is the difference the nth last child selector is very similar to nth last of type but with one critical difference that it is less specific so in our example we would produce the same result because we are iterating only li elements but if we were iterating over a more complex group of siblings nth last child would try to match all siblings not only siblings of the same element type so this reveals the power of nth last child and it can select any sibling element in an arrangement not only element that are specified before the colon let's talk about browser support so nth last child was introduced in css selectors module 3 which means the old versions of browsers do not support it but modern browser support is very good and the new sudo selectors are widely used in production environment as well so that's all for nth child css nth last child css sudo selector hope you like this video please subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed yet thanks see you soon